Hey everybody, I'm down at the toy store and I really don't want to be jumping into new projects with all of the toys I need to price, but something has to give right here. This Barbie display, it's almost empty. It kind of looks janky anyway right there. I've got a lot of toys in this section right here that just aren't selling, they're older, or they're just not popular. I need the room. I really don't want to jump into this now but I'm gonna have to do it. I'm gonna be changing this up, getting it out of here. I'm gonna try to do it quick like, because I have a bunch of work to do. It needs to happen. I almost got ahead of myself here. Anything in this box is $4.99. I probably need to price it. That way I don't mix it up with everything else, but better price this first and then get going. All of this Disney Raya, is it Raya or Raya? Anyway, that stuff's going into a box until I can figure out what I'm doing with it. This is a fun little project, it needed to happen. This aisle has kind of gotten out of control right here. It's gotta be a little bit better. It needs to be organized. I'll be throwing up some pegboard hooks. It should look a little better. And then my brother and I are gonna slat wall that corner this weekend. And we'll kind of see what that looks like. Yikes, I got into this and it's just been a big time sink. I did get this looking a lot better. I put another shelf right here, but I am cutting it close here. I gotta get some of the new stuff priced and get it out. We're talking Friday, baby. And Fridays are usually pretty busy in the toy store. The crazy thing is, the problem is I'm playing catch up. I don't wanna use the word neglected, but there's a lot of things around the store that have needed to be done. I'm down to the wire, but I'm getting it put back up. We did sell three more of the Vanessa Tempos on eBay. I've got a box of Raya stuff that's going in the back. Another box of just whatever. Here's kind of where I'm at with this stuff. You have a lot of little toys that need to hang up. They look okay on the shelves, right? But they really need to be hung up in their own little spot. The problem is I need more space for Barbie. That's why we're thinking if we can get the front wall slat walled, we can move some stuff up there and free up a whole section just for Barbie, LOL, Monster High, Rainbow High, whatever's going at the time, because we just need it. We need more space and we are getting really creative in the building with space. I've got a couple shelves here from this whole endeavor that I am going to put. Follow me along here. Oh, I'm gonna be using them in here. I need a shelf here and I need a shelf here. That should give me some space right here to work with. And we are like T minus two hours until we open and I really need to get some stuff priced. I know I'm saying it, and it's like, hey, why are you walking around filming if you need to price stuff? I gotta keep everybody updated. You need the updates. And what do we got going here? I got, whoa, almost tripped there. All right, here's the dealio. I've been in here five, maybe six hours. I managed to get this Barbie section kind of cleaned up, looking a little bit better. Let's face it, I'm playing catch up. I am so far behind in the store. When you're trying to do a full-time business part-time, it all piles up on you. And that's what I'm kind of experiencing this week. I have gotten zero, and I mean zero pricing done. I've got about a half hour until I open the doors here and we are looking pretty rough. It's not all Debbie Downer, doom and gloom. The good news is these tubs price out pretty fast. So I'm gonna jump into it and I hope we're really busy today. What else? Oh, the Tonys. I had to pull them all off the shelves. I sold one yesterday and she messaged me this morning and said, hey, 
This thing works fine. It works great while it's plugged in. As soon as you unplug it, it doesn't work anymore. The batteries in it are shot. So I pulled all of them off the shelves. I plugged them all in, let them charge. And I do have one that's working properly. So I swapped it into a pink unit like she bought and I'm gonna give it to her when she comes in. But I'm considering those Tonys kind of a no-go. I gotta think the batteries are bad. Right now it's 50-50. Half of the batteries have worked, half of them haven't. And yeah, it's a little unfortunate, but I did tell her yesterday, I said, hey, there is the possibility that the battery in this might not work. And I don't know if I jinxed myself, but that's the situation. I'm not even sure where I was at. We got swamped. We were busy all day. And I kept thinking it was Saturday because we were so busy, but it's Friday, which is good. No one's complaining. And I, um, I don't know. I just locked the door and I did set aside some toys. I want to show everybody out of the new target load, a couple toys here. Wow. What a day. Great day. We saw some regulars, got some new people that found us on Facebook. So a good mix of customers today, but I know what I want to talk about. The Tonys. Here's kind of what's going on. I pulled all the Tonys off the shelves, started charging them, and I could only get one to really work right. Then I pulled some of these Tonys that came with the new batch out, plugged them in and they worked fine. Even if you unplug them, they'll work. So yes, I'm not sure what's going on with these. If you look, it seems to work okay. Now this one, the box definitely looks scuffed up. This is a Toy Story Woody. I will plug him in, get him tested. Maybe it was just bad luck, who knows, right? Before we get out of here, I wanna run through a few toys and I know it's not as many as we're used to seeing, but we were busy and I had a lot going today. I had a kid bring this up to the register and he wanted to check it out. He wanted me to open it. This was this dog E one in a million robot dog. So we pulled it out, we set it up, turned it on and it works perfect. Matter of fact, it was in the packaging, almost like it was unopened and the box just got scuffed. So this does work. He wanted it, but I don't think his mom was on board. I taped it all back up, priced it out, and now it is ready to go to its new home. Checking out some action figures, TMNT, Mikey in Disguise from the 90s movie. I love this movie. As a matter of fact, it is playing at the movie theater right in my line of sight. The movie theater is right there. We can see it from the window maybe we can see it they are doing the tmnt original movie the throwback i guess we're calling it these days while we're on tmnt i never see donatello's here is a donatello and we have splinter very cool disney pixar cars and we are missing lightning mcqueen unfortunately somebody snagged him and this will just be a piece on my shelf. I've noticed some Smithsonian toys in this batch. We did have a batch maybe two or three loads ago. Every single one was bad, but these are actually sealed. I did test one of the electric staticky ball thingies. This thing right here, the plasma ball. I actually put batteries in that bad boy, tested it and it worked. I'm pretty antsy about the electronics right now. And that's because the Tony's the run of bad Tonys. I'm really trying to test everything. I don't want to get that reputation. Hey, that place sells junk, you know, it never works. I'm trying to be really careful and double checking all the electronic stuff. Of the forest, ready, to go. ready to rock and roll, VTech. That was in this load. Switching positions, I had a tote of toys. I wanted to show everybody just some different stuff. This is a Dream Seekers Follow Your Dreams. And I hadn't seen these before. Lots of good Barbie in here. We always get good Barbie from Target. Here's some Gabby's dollhouse. Lots of big dolls in here. Lots of mystery balls. We've got Duplo. We've got Fisher Price Little People. A really nice variety in this haul. And I can't wait to really dig in, spread some of this stuff out and show everybody what we got. It's probably gonna be a weird video. I'm kind of losing my voice. I keep thinking it's Saturday, 
but it is only Friday. I hope everybody is having a great weekend. And until next time, I will see you later. Peace.